Hey guys, what is up? It is SST Middleman here with Guides for Assault, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the missing laser pistol unique weapon in Fallout New Vegas. So, what you're going to need to do is have decent reputation with uh, the Brotherhood of Steel, and then head to this Hidden Valley Bunker, which will actually have Brotherhood of Steel members in it. They're going to ask you to complete a quest where you will have to get rid of an NCR member from the Brotherhood of Steel Hidden Valley, and then once you do, come talk to Hello. Knight Torres here, who's like the receptionist at the Armory, know, and inventory. ask her about uh, if there's anything you could help her with. She'll let you know that there is a laser pistol that has gone missing, hence the name Missing Laser Pistol, and she will ask you to go look for it. So once you talk to her, come talk Welcome to this to paladin range. here that is sitting right behind her at Torres the firing range, and My he will let you know that the last person he saw was Initiate Stanton. So now to find Initiate Stanton, you can usually find him in the classroom on the same floor right here. If he's not there, he's probably yes, wandering around, know. or it's nighttime, so wait till daytime and you'll be able to find him. So ask Look, him about the laser pistol, he'll tell you that him and his friend had snuck out the other day, and they were going to Scorpion Gulch to fight some scorpions, so but there were too many, they got overpowered, and he ran away dropping the pistol. So, you're going to want to head to Scorpion Gulch right here, and on this rock right in the middle of it will be the missing laser pistol. I'll show you the location right here in a minute. It is just uh, southwest of the Hidden Valley, so you shouldn't really have that much trouble finding it. Now that we have found the missing laser pistol, I'm going to read to you about it off of the Fallout Wiki. So, the missing laser pistol is a unique version of the laser pistol that is only found during the unmarked quest pistol packing, obviously. It also has the same stats as the standard laser pistol, with the exception of lower damage and critical damage. So, as you can see, the missing laser pistol is not a weapon you would go for to be running around using all the time because it's just so awesome. But, uh, I guess it's a unique weapon, so it's something to go for, just so you can say you've collected all the unique weapons. Anyways, unlike the laser pistol, it is possible to use the iron sights on this weapon. However, the missing laser pistol cannot use any of the energy cell variants, such as energy cell or overcharge. So you can only use standard, uh, standard shots. Also, something I found with the missing laser pistols you see in the gameplay, sometimes when you shoot when you're scoped in, it'll just zoom out to hip fire. You can't actually shoot this thing while aiming down sights, although you can aim down sights. Once you shoot, it's going to aim out of aim down sights. So, the missing laser pistol can fire a total of about 995 times using standard cells, the equivalent of 34 reloads from full condition before breaking. Obviously, you can only fire standard cells like it stated before. And, um, obviously the pistol won't appear until the proper sequence of conversations have taken place. You cannot just go to Scorpion Gulch and find it there. You have to be doing the quest to find it there. That's why it's so important. Some notes about it. As it is a quest item, the weapon will not be removed in instances where your weapons are removed from your inventory while entering certain locations, such as holdout locations, holdout weapon locations, or the Sierra Madre. Also, for some odd reason, the missing laser pistol's Pip-Boy icon shows a plasma pistol rather than a laser pistol. I have no idea how they messed that up. I mean, I guess they really did not care about the missing laser pistol. Also, like I said before, since it won't be taken out of your inventory, um, you can just walk into, let's say, the Dead Money DLC, and where you would normally start off with nothing, you will have the missing laser pistol. So that's one thing it could actually be useful for. Do note, once you complete the quest, you will no longer have the missing laser pistol, and instead, uh, the person you return it to will give you a tri-beam laser rifle instead. Also, one bug with the weapon, sometimes it just doesn't spawn at all. Uh, if you can't find it, just make sure you talk to Initiate Stanton. And if you're playing on PC, you could just use console commands to spawn it if it's not spawning for you. And yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about the weapon. It's not that great, but it is a unique weapon. So if you're going for all of them, you got to go for this one too. Anyways, thanks for watching the video, guys. If you enjoyed, please leave a like rating down below and subscribe to see some more videos in the future. See you guys next time. Goodbye.